My name is Gordon Walker. My family and I spend the summers in Turkey and some of it sailing in the Indigean Sea. On the morning of uh, September 2nd, I was with my wife Sonia, my young daughter Nikita, and an Emily friend. We came across a sight no experienced sailor ever, ever wants to see. Life jets. Soon we saw that there were also backpacks, large and small, in the water. The waterlogged banks were extremely heavy. It was a major effort to get them in the back of the boat. boat. Nikita asked, why are there so many, so many life jackets? Why are there pack sacks with everything they have in the water? Why indeed? The pack sacks may have been dumped to give the boat more freeboard. It would ride higher in the water and be safer. The other, po other possibility is that their vessel was swamped and sank somewhere along the 14th kilometer crossing to Lesbos. We made a report to the police, then we opened the bags. What we were seeing were, were the belongings of the people who risked everything on the chance of getting to Europe. There were clothes, cig cigarettes, cell phones, chargers, cables, water bottles, and a lot of toiletries. As we got deeper into the bags, the clothes of a very young child appeared. Diapers, a toddler's little hat. As we dug still deeper into the bags, I found some identifying details. Three, three passports belonging to a young Iranian family. We found a Koran and a prayer booklet, disposable diapers, a fishing kit, enough to get to A to B and not much else. We'd certainly like to know what happened to the people in that boat. 